Hey, and welcome to Ark Survival Evolved. You might think I'm crazy with my moonwalking giga. I made the saddle for him a really long time, and I finally come back with my quets. That's not what we're doing today. Ooh, a spino. I already have like four, so I've tamed loads of spinos. Um, that's not what we're after today. What we are after is um, Bigfoots. I'm gonna pick up a leg for and bring him back to my house. I don't care how long the flight is. It might be a five minute flight back to my house from where we find the Bigfoot. But I am doing it. I'm gonna fly and go get the a Pachyranthosaurus. And I gotta feed these guys bug repellent, but they look super cool. If I need to what I did is look, if I can't find a big foot, I'll just hit destroy. I'll just use that command right there. I am playing single player. Nobody is joining me. So that you know. There's loads of Brontos there. I might need the meat, but my Quetzal is almost to the brim of full. Because this Giga weighs so much on my Quetzal. My Quetzal was like a half weight, and now he's almost full. So he might be like 500 weight, maybe, the Giga? Because my Quetzal does have... Uh, not me, but... My Quetz has 2,700... Actually, he might be like a thousand weight, maybe? Half? Yeah, a thousand weight, this Giga. He weighs so incredibly much. I have not found any... I have not had any luck in this first one minute of getting Bigfoot. I do not know where he is. There's a Paracer Theory. I don't even know what they're called. But... The weird pink looking guys with the long necks. They're like the arc giraffes. I found one. I have a Bigfoot in sight. Hopefully he's going to be a high level. Let me land. Jump off. Check what level he is. And if he's like level 1, I'll pick him up. He's level 20. So I will pick him up. But I don't have any kibble or anything for him. Here we go. Did I pick him up? Yes. He's still walking. He, he thinks he's he thinks he's he's moving. Is that another Bigfoot or is that just a moose? Okay. I'm going to have to fly so slow. I should just start making my way back, you know what? This Bigfoot will do. I have a cage at my house for the Bigfoot. It'll do because I cannot risk this with my Giga on because I got I gotta bring my Giga back home safely. He's been sitting there for the longest time. There's a lot of Gallimimuses and Pteranodons. There's always a million Pteranodons in the Redwood, but an Argent is probably you don't want to always have Quetzals, but an Argent is pretty good. Oh, I, ha I had I have kibble for that guy. Probably not enough, but. And he's a cool, cool red color. I can't, I can't get sidetracked, cause the more I'll get sidetracked, the heavier this will become, and and then we just won't be able to fly. Cause my Giga is is level fifty. I do say that I want to tame another one, but I'm gonna wait till I have Quetzal leg kibble. So I gotta tame another Quetz before that. So that's gonna be a bit of a. <laughs> Bummer, because we can't tame another Giga. But I want my Giga to get, like, a really high level and to tame really fast. That's a cool green-colored Spino. I have a red Spino and then two, like, gray with a bit of pink on their back. The red is a female, and uh, the one of the ones with gray and pink on their back is a male, and the other one's a female. And they have, it's, like, silver, no, not silver, light gray, Yellow and pink. And there's another one. But, nah, I can't pick up these guys. Ooh. He's a really good color, though. I don't even have tranks on me, so. I just brought some bullets in defense. So, look. Oh, but every time I land for stamina, I need to continue flying. Because every single time, 
I go to get stamina, my Bigfoot's gonna fall, and then it's not gonna be good for him. So I need to find a place so that I can drop Bigfoot down. Not next to a T-Rex. Haven't seen any T-Rexes, though. So, there's another Bigfoot there. Okay, okay, okay. Let me land here. Wait, let me first look at the area. If worse comes to worse, I have a Giga on me, so... That's pretty good. I want to bring both of these Bigfoots. So, I gotta find a way how to get... Two Bigfoots. There's no way to, like, leash them. What level is he? Eight. So, I don't have any berries on me. You know what? I had a plan of taming Bigfoot back at my house. But, you know what? I can't, because there's two. And every Bigfoot counts. I thought I was just going to have trouble finding one Bigfoot. I found two. Because, you know, Sasquatch, he's supposed to be really hard to find. Nobody has ever seen him in real life. Well, because he's not even real. Pfft. My Giga is going nuts. Is there anything else? Wait. Oh. I didn't need to shoot him, but... He's level 8. We have a... Whoa! Oh, they're... Okay. How many pikeheads do compies take? There's normally like a Bigfoot out on the edge here in the water. Not normally. I mean, there has been. What is this thing? Okay, these things are, are not to be messed with. Ooh, they can kill you so easily. Because they do that. Ooh! Oh, get him! Cause he go invisible. Reload. Ah! How many bullets did that guy take? No, there's more of them. And I don't have a bed on my. And welcome to Ark Survival Evolved. We're back. We're back in Ark. Um, the we're back. 
my Bigfoot right here. You guys might have remembered him. He's kind of encumbered now. Let me upgrade his weight. Because he's kind of fat. We got Bigfoot right here. Which I changed his name to Musclefoot. I really can't find a good name for him, so let's just put Accept Zero. His name is right now going to be Giganotopithecus, whatever that is. Okay. Let me put him onto neutral, actually. There you go. Um, if anybody finds a name, put it down in the comments. But what we're going to be doing is... My house is painted orange. Yes, it is. Beautiful orange. What we're going to be doing for the end of this video... So that's our big foot in all of his glory. He has a cool punch. You can put masks on him, which is pretty sweet. But what we're going to be doing is put adding somebody to our wall, sign wall. The person that we will be adding today, their name is... I'm just going to put whatever their YouTube name is. And if the person... This is anybody who puts a comment. If you put a comment, you'll have a chance to enter here. Um, but... The, the person who's put the most comments in my videos is BMX Zach the Gamer. So I'm just going to be adding one person about. I'm looking at it right now, so this is exactly how you spell it. Yeah, he has his name caps and BMX, but everything else is not caps. So we'll be adding one person to the wall sign. To the. What am I going to call this? The Metal Wall of Fame. We have. I don't even know if you can read it. BM Exact the Gamer. Yay, you can read it. It's not like Minecraft signs where they're pretty big. But we've got that. Don't worry about the house. I'll do another video once it's finished. It's not finished now. You can see the paint. But we did that, so it's just Bigfoot now. We've got our Bigfoot. Lots of Rex eggs. And I think I can. Wait, if I. Let me see if I can do this. This is the only other thing I'm talking about about Bigfoot. Is that I could grab my hat and place it here. That looks sweet. He has a standard, like, just punch. He has a pretty nice punch. He breaks berries when he hits them. But he gathers no fiber, as you see. The way that he gathers fiber is if I leave him here, um, put Enable Wandering on him, and now he will, as you can see, you see him, he's walking around, and look at the bush. And now if I put Disabled Wandering on him, he's disabled. So now he'll stop. And look how much fiber he's gotten in that little bit. Bigfoot, he gets so much fiber. So what you can do is, if you have like a fenced off area where there's lots of trees, like... Like up there, you'll set him up there, and he'll gather all that fiber for you. He's a decent farm fiber gatherer. If the three business stores are really hard, not really hard, but they're pretty hard to get, this guy gathers more fiber than the Bigfoot. Let me upgrade his. I like going for, you know, let me go for health. Health. He has a pretty good melee damage, because I upgrade his melee damage a lot. Stamina, I'd rather have him stronger than really stamina it up. But look how much fiber he gets. Oh, yeah, you don't attack it. Um, he does this as his second ability. Little finger pickles. It's not about him, but he gets he gets a very decent fiber. And if you just run like this and you tap it rapidly, look how much fiber you have. So yeah, if you if you don't want to gather fiber yourself and just wanna, let me let me just go up here and see all this, how much he really does. Let me wait for stamina. So if, if he's mainly up to if you don't want to gather stamina yourself then you could get a Bigfoot. Yeah, a Bigfoot. So I'm literally just sprint through here, and I've got so much fiber already. So I, I do have to say that this guy, he's harder to tame. He's not automated, though. You do have to get on him. It doesn't take that much time at all, so I think he's a lot more effective than Bigfoot because I've already got 2,000, almost 3,000 fiber. L look at his inventory. 72 weight, almost just in fiber. So I have to say that that guy is better. Whoa, I'm still punching. A bit of lag. I'll punch my own Bigfoot. He's a lot better than Bigfoot. So that is about it, guys. I have to say that Bigfoot's good because he's automated. 
So you can have like an automated gatherer, but oh no! Why am I still? Buddy, stop punching Bigfoot! Look, I'm not clicking anything on my controller. I'm serious. If I can pick there, I literally hit the punch button and it just stops. Great. And yeah, my game is a bit glitchy now, but it's fine. It's about Bigfoot. Look at him. Stand here next to Bigfoot. And this is how we're going to end off our video. Where is he? Right here. Me and Bigfoot. How do I, how do I zoom out? It's not that for sure. Is it this? No. It's not LT. It's not this. This is literally turned out into. There we go. LB. Me and Bigfoot. <laughs> best of buds. <laughs> I'm Bigfoot's best bro. So that has concluded this episode, guys. That will be all, folks. As you say, we'll be adding people to the metal wall sign of fame. Not really fame. Just if you just put a comment, I'll add you in. So. There's the gig that we got earlier, so. Good. Bye. Everyone. Hopefully you enjoyed. That will be all. So. Bye bye. Peace.